hate the police so much. But I'm in between. I have to take a very objective view of a professional, uh, you know, um, police force. It's huge. It's got 34,000 people. It's well equipped, it's well trained. It's one of the best elite force in the world. And it, it, one of the top police, you know, constitution in Asia. And you know, I think between Sri Lanka and, and our police department, we've got a lot of exchange programs as well. And I've been working f with IPCC for four, four years by, by, by the time the Occupy movement took place. And I knew many high-ranking police officers. I knew that there are bad elements within the police, but they are the minority, very, very small, tiny portion of the police force uh, were bad sheep. But of course, because of the political atmosphere, I, I think, um, you know, when a policeman see, saw me, and then they, I think they, they, they're just thinking, oh, who, who's this kind of guy who always try to, um, you know, uh, monitor us and attack us whenever he got a chance to do so, but I didn't. I, I think I have to be fair to each and every one of them. Each case is different. Um, after the Occupy movement, I think people gradually come into better reasoning. And then I think the police force is still uh, a capable professional uh, police force. And I would also remind that they should maintain political neutrality in handling all these you know, very sensitive uh, social movements. They need to maintain political neutrality. Um, I have some concern, of course, during the Occupy movement, that they're being used as a political tool to suppress the student movement. Mm -hmm. And ICAC, I think, um, the ranking of Hong Kong in the Perception Index What's that index called? I can't remember. Um, it ranks the countries uh, by the degree of corruption. Uh, it's, a, it's kind of perception index only. Uh, Hong Kong's gone down the drain quite quite a bit from number six or seven to up to, I think the worst that we, we did was number 16. Probably because of this, all the scandals we had uh, from the former chief um, secretary for administration, uh, because of Donald Zhang's case and all of that. Uh, but gradually, uh, from last year onwards, we, we, our position climbed a little bit. And of course, we've got some scandals within the ICAC as well. You know the former commissioner, um, uh, Mr. Tong, who has been summoned to this council and faced the Public Accounts Committee inquiry. I was leading the inquiry and he did a lot of stupid things it's not illegal but he did a lot of things like you know uh, traveling too much eating too much maybe <laughs> drinking too much it's not very it's not crime it's not criminal but all these little things put together that just create a very bad impression of the head of ICAC being just a you know, this type of, you know, person. So it doesn't look good. It didn't look good. And so it's the Mr. Tong's case. That was quite a drama within the council. We had a six or seven hearings, summoned him to um, the council in, in, and he was grilled by all of us, all seven of us in the public council committee. And we did issue a very condemning report, you know, condemning him. In public mm. and he I think uh, they got a really bad mark from us and that was a black mark for the ICS as well and of course we got some also some internal promotion issues uh, maybe you have read about it uh, you know an acting um, head of operation could not get promotion after acting for a year and there are some media reports saying that because of his political stand or, or because 
she, not like he, is a she, was involved in handling the investigation of CY Leung on the UGL case. You know about the UGL case. You know my involvement on the UGL case. And that's why you're coming to me. <laughs> but I think um, from a commercial perspective, I, think, I don't think the UGL uh, transaction should be done in that way without any disclosure uh, from the chief executive. But of course, you know that I, I am still involving in a civil defamation litigation with him, so I could not talk too much on this. So excuse me 